Hi, I'm Raul. Um, I'm a solutions consultant at eBex, a DXE company. Uh, I'm just going to run through some of my tips on making sure that um, implementing a system like this is less disruptive uh, and, and more valuable. A few considerations here is, you know, one, keeping down the lead time of the project. Um, two, you know, we might be interested in a certain aspect of the project, but it doesn't um, fit with the overall strategic plan of the business, so we, we might park that until later on. Um, but I think if we identify what those um, key components are at an early stage, it makes um, life much easier in terms of the, the roadmap. So we want to make sure we have the right project team on our side and, and on the customer side. Uh, we want to make sure we get the right people involved at the right time. Um, so for example, we, want, we might want the CFO involved, um, not in the day-to-day -day running of the project, but, um, but really to be a, um, a sponsor of the project, for example. Um, we want to make sure that in people's diaries and in the calendars, they, they know when some of the key deliverables are and we're not, we're not going over um, some key dates for the business, for example, end of quarter. Um, but once we've got the right team in place, we can make sure that the project um, becomes more successful moving forwards. So another tip is make sure we have good communication. Uh, we want to really win the hearts and minds of everyone in the business who will be using the system. Uh, we want to communicate up and down the business, you know, really let them know what's going on, uh, what new features are going to uh, come in, uh, what systems might be going away. Um, so I, th I think, you know, make sure we, we, we cover the communication well on that side. So another tip is to make sure we create a good roadmap. Um, we want to make sure that people throughout the business know what's coming in in the short term, you know what's coming in the long term. Um, there might be a department who's not getting any of the features until a year down the line. Uh, but I think if, if we've got that roadmap, we've got the future vision of what's going on, um, it, it ties into the previous tip around um, communication. So another tip is, you know, if, if we use something called product first, um, you know, we're not recreating, reinventing the wheel around functionality and features. So we're actually thinking about data quite early on in the project um, and, you know, make sure we've got a nice clean system uh, with, with good data that we can use for reporting. Uh, alongside that, we're, we're making sure we've got the right security, right. Um, the right people accessing the right information 